At CBIT, Europe's biggest electronics show held in Hanover, there were lots of new gizmos and gadgets on display. More than 4,200 companies from 70 countries were there to show off their new products. The theme, however, was managing trust, internet security and data protection. The German Federal Printing House presented the new German identity card. It's more secure because instead of using a magnetic strip which is easy to clone, it features new encryption technology. Using this card with a reader, users can identify themselves from home, connect to public offices, receive all kinds of documents via the internet and also use it like a bank card. I think authentication, trust, uh, is one of the, the main aspects of uh, real business and this will bring trust into the digital business. IBM presented the secure desktop which enables users to access their entire desktop including their OS, apps and data from anywhere in the world. The secret is this stick which gives access via a secure connection to the user's data stored in a cloud. We believe that we don't want to be lugging around large devices like this through airports and so on because it's unpleasanter. What we would prefer to do is simply go to an arbitrary computer, one which we've never seen before, insert a simple device such as this one, the stick, and make it to our own computer. Once we unplug the device after having worked with the session for a while, none of the data left behind is usable because everything is encrypted by the cryptographic technology on the stick. Here at CBIT it's possible to get your portrait done, but the artist is not a human, it's a very clever robot. The robot detects light reflections via a camera on its arm, which takes the person's picture. Then the robot's software finds the contrasts in the image and translates them into arm movements for the robot. What's the function of this robot in your laboratories? At our laboratory, we are measuring the reflection of materials. For example, road signs. You see, at night you want to see uh, what is written on the sign. And therefore, it is essential to know that all the reflected light is coming back towards you. Controversial footballing decisions by referees could be history, thanks to a microchip inside this ball, which can give accurate real-time information on ball possession, passes, crosses and shots, as well as player speeds and distance covered. And here's a tablet for users who get caught in the rain. Fujitsu's waterproof device can be left up to a metre underwater for half an hour and still function. It's due to be launched onto the Japanese market soon. But new technology isn't confined to small gadgets. This Audi A3 model is fitted with a huge amount of new technology. This retractable display gives all sorts of information. There's also a powerful voice recognition system and a letter recognition device. You write the first and second letter of your destination and the car recognizes your writing. There's also a powerful 3G modem for data connection and streaming the internet. And finally, British company Robothespian has developed an advanced voice recognition system for robots. If you're an actor, then play Hamlet. To be or not to be? That is the question.